head coach, Brandon Hopkins. And uh, you're about 10 seconds uh, at, you know, f from the end of the game. Pilot Points put together two first down drives. A touchdown wins the game for them. And then what happened? Well, it was, it was a pretty wild scene. They, uh, <laughs> they got a big first down just by the nose of the ball. And there's, you know, there's not – much time left, 20, 30 seconds, and uh, we stop them a couple times, and you know there's just uh, five, six, seven, eight seconds left on the clock, and they just kind of throw hail mary into the end zone and gets batted up, and Fino, Fino comes <laughs> comes to life. Yeah, Fino Cardona, Cardona comes up with it uh, with the interception as a as the uh, time went to zero, so that was a heck of a game. He didn't he didn't just come to life; he played a big part in, in the entire ball game. Uh, and you know that um, that that sack by by Chase uh, Graham. How key was that play? Yeah, we had we had a couple key sacks down the stretch. Uh, Graham had a big sack. Uh, Tyler Souter had a big sap, sack. Uh, Adrian Nelson actually had five sacks on the game, so he had a heck of a heck of a game defensively. So, coach, you look at you know how tight that score was at the end. How how big then do those missed uh, uh, point after? Uh, attempts. Uh, how, do, how how big do they loom at that point? And is that something you're going to talk about this week? Well, we've that's stuff that we've uh, you know we've been working on. It, what happened was we we had a bad snap on one of them, then we missed one, then we started having to catch up on the points. You know, it ended up you know they missed a couple also, so that's why the score was 24 to 19 when it you know it could have been 28 21 just if everybody makes their extra points. So, well, you faced some uh, some tough opponents to this point, and uh, you you weren't surprised by Pilot Point, were you? No, we knew they were a very solid team. Uh, you know, th that game could have went could have went any either way. So, and you're that's exactly <laughs> right. With one play, could have swung it. Yeah, you know, we're we're sitting now at two and zero in district and four and two overall in the six games we played. You know, we could we could be six and zero. We could be an zero and six. We you know we've been in every every game has been a been a battle down to the end. So. That just shows how critical every play is. Uh, uh, in a ball game like that, um, especially. Uh, who's next? Uh, we've got uh, Kalisburg up next. We got to go up there on Friday, and that's going to be a that's going to be a tough game. They uh, they played Pilot Point tough the first district game, and they they have one of the better athletes in the uh, in the district in uh, number four Clay McKenzie. So, so your work cut out for you, at, even then. Yeah, it's going to be a tough it's going to be a tough game down to the down to the wire again. I imagine. Well, are you feeling uh, pretty happy where your team is right now? Oh yeah, going into the season, if you'd say we're two and zero in district, playing probably two of the top few teams in our district to start off with, and you know, and to be two and zero, that's uh, you know, that says a lot for the for the kids for sure. Absolutely, congratulations to to your team and and to you, uh, coach, uh, as you move uh, on ahead in uh, in district play. Let's talk to a couple of those athletes, can we? Okay. A medical emergency can happen when we least expect it. Luckily, Faith Community Hospital is around the corner with a level four trauma center ready when you need us. We're back, Coach Hopkins. A couple of your standout guys in that really exciting and standout game on Friday night. Introduce them. We want to visit with these guys. We have uh, Brett Wilson, starting a senior starting defensive tackle, and then Parker Rivers, senior starting uh, left tackle. Terrific. Step over that way. It was Brad? Brett. Brett? Okay. Uh, tell me, you know, your feeling from down on the field a game like that Friday night, I just got through visiting with Coach about it. Very, very exciting, very close game. One play could have could have could have swung that game the other direction. What's it feel like playing a game like that? Uh, it was exciting, like you said. Got it just got me going from the get go, or you know, did it tension build through the course of the night? Uh, the tension kind of built, but the adrenaline and our team, we kept our composure, and we ended up coming out with a win. What was your position again? Do you play both sides? I mostly play offense, left tackle. Left tackle, and how about you? I mainly play defense, the defensive tackle. Terrific. You guys are down there where the action, where the, where the rubber meets the road. Was there some grunting and hitting going on down there on Friday night? Yes, there was. Those guys had to be pretty tough to keep up with the, with, with the Yellow Jackets. They are, <laughs> but we're tougher. Yeah, well, evidently. And boy, like I say, one play could have swung that game. What what happens in your mind? We're talking about your feelings down on the field. What happens in your mind when, uh, let's say, when Chase Graham gets that gets that big sack, ten seconds left, gets a big sack, keeps them out of the end zone. I go crazy. <laughs> or actually put them in put them put them in. Uh, I think back at the, about the 30, 31 yard line, so that they had to hail Mary. Uh, I just want to congratulate the man. <laughs> he saved it. Y'all y'all carry him or Fino off the field on your shoulders. I want to know. <laughs> <laughs> it would have been Fino. Yeah, yeah. He, he makes the, he makes the very important pick at the at the at the end of the game. 
Mm -hmm. yeah. And Chase stepped up for it, and Fino closed it for us. Well, it's a team. Uh, how close is this team? Uh, we're really close as a whole. Yeah. Well, if you guys seniors, I forget. Yes, sir. Yeah. You got football in your future, or is it way too early to know? I don't know yet. I'd like to keep playing, but how about you? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I've got a couple places. Good for you. How about uh, career-wise? Is it too early for that, or do you have some idea uh, what maybe you want to study in college? What direction your career might go? Uh, probably sports medicine. Super. What about you? I don't know. I'm still thinking about that stuff. Yeah, yeah way too early, way, way too early uh, to have to make that decision now. Well, listen, did you all have a great summer? Summer's over now. I mean, there's some fall football weather in the air. But how about your summer? Was it good? It was great. Time off? Uh, a little bit, and then right back into football. Yeah. Vacation for you? Uh, a little bit. Mainly spent time with family and friends and had football. So yeah, I bet it was a lot of football. Listen, best of luck to you. You're 2-0 in district, and keep up the good work. Best of luck. Thank you. Thank you.